Okay, for the second hand, we're going to do it the same way as the first. Uh, one of the nice things about using this wire is that you can bend it and get it to where you want it. And you're sewing around it. So you'll still have some room to adjust and have it pointing the direction you want, have the kite going where you want it to go, uh, how close do you want it to be to the girl, and so forth. So again, carefully around, pull it tight, do that about four times, and then make the wrist. Okay, so last fingers, we're going to come out to make the wrist. One of the things that I really wanted with this pattern was for it to be flexible enough you could do other things with it, dress them other ways, you know, put, your, put your own spin on things, but also make it so that the sewing was not terribly difficult. And by sewing around the wires, you can adjust them the way you choose. I mean, you can probably imagine lots of different things to do with this basic idea. And when you do, of course, you need to post some pictures for me on the Iris Cottage Facebook page or on Quirky Sue's Designs Facebook page or in your comments on YouTube. Okay. One last little snip there, and we can arrange the wires, arrange the kites, have them spin down if you like. But you have a lot of flexibility in how you arrange your little girl and her kite.